Hey everybody, I'm Jamie and welcome to the Shoe Review. Today we're going to be reviewing the ASICS Gel Kyano 18. One of the unique features of the Gel Kyano is the IGS, Impact Guidance System. The IGS is going to help you go in a forward motion from heel to toe. When running, you never want to go side to side. IGS will keep you on that forward path. Another feature I love about the Kyano is that it has a great heel counter. They put the heel counter on the outside to really show you the stability that you're going to get while using the sneaker. I also love that it's on the outside because when you're in the sneaker, your heel is not going to be rubbed up against the inside and that makes for a great feature right there. Now talking about the inside, we have the biomorphic fit around the heel. This is a memory foam. I mean, what it's going to do is really hug your heel so that you're not going to slip at all and you're going to get a very comfortable fit. After that, what I like is the logo. No one really realizes this, but their logo is placed so that when you're tying your sneaker and you're pulling on the eyelets, it's wrapping around your foot. And that's great because it's extra support that's always needed. What's nice about the Kayana also is that they put this fabric right here that's very lightweight, flexible, and if you have anything like a bunion or a tailor's bunion on the outside, that's great too because this is going to give you a little extra room and a little extra give. Whenever looking at a sneaker, the sole, you're going to see two different material. You're going to see a white EVA and then you're going to see a gray area, which is called the Duo Max. The white is always cushion. No matter what, whenever you're looking at a sneaker, this is your cushion. Duo Max, though, is a denser material that's going to help you from rolling in or pronate. This sneaker offers great Duo Max. It's a pretty big piece, so it's covering all the way from the heel to the forefoot. Really makes for a great support. And then on the inside, you have the tech plate. I mean, this is not going to let the sneaker turn at all, and that's what you want. You never want to come down on your heel and have this roll, and then you're going to roll right to the side. By having this tech plate, it's going to give you that forward motion, which also involved with the IGS helps you so that you're not supinating or pronating. The main thing with the Kyano that they want to let you know about is the gel. They put gel in the heel to the forefoot. They want to show you on this side where the gel is so you get a good image of what you're standing on. On the other side they don't show you that. That's okay though because it is fully across the sneaker. This gel is just going to give you a little extra shock absorption so when you're hitting that hard, hard pavement you're not sending all that impact up your legs, but it's sending it out instead. A new thing with the 18 is that they wrapped around this sole-like cushioning right in between the sole and the mesh. This wrapped around all the way to the other side is going to give you just a little bit more shock absorption that maybe another sneaker might not have. So a quick overview of the Gelcano 18 is that it's a very cushioned sneaker made to take impact this sneaker in general is going to help a pronator. If you roll in, this is made for you. If your arch is low or flat, this sneaker is what's going to help you run more miles, take more impact, get less leg pain. This is what you're going to get. Even if you're a walker, it's okay. This is made to take impact, so if you're only walking every day, you're going to be happy in this because you're not going to feel any pain and you're not going to break it down easy.